Yeah. As, uh, just because they had this, uh, one nice run at Rubicon, which I really liked. Yeah, they, they do pretty well in doubles, and it's funny when they play. It also sucks when they have to play each other. But like, it's a very interesting match when they have, like when O'Reilly and Dreffen have to play each other. Really? It's yeah. Singles? Why? Because uh, like Dreffen actually usually beats Dreffen, but Dreffen's considered the better player. <laughs> oh, oh, O'Reilly usually beats Dreff? Really? Yeah, I oh. know, right? That's, 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 that's nuts. Yeah. That's a tough matchup, too. Chicago. Chris no, looking been. super serious. The glasses. <laughs> looking styling the, most out. the most serious I've ever <laughs> seen him in my life. <laughs> we'll see if they come off. <laughs> oh, we have, we, have, uh, we have the bat signal in the background. Pr Prince, Look up Prince, Prince Lombard. <laughs> Prince Lombard. <laughs> Prince of Lombard. <laughs> For those that don't know, uh, Abu is no longer Michigan. Yeah, he's he's, he's chilling in west side, west of Chicago. Michigan cut out their worst player and gave him. Tw <laughs> yeah, no, no, no. We know we traded we <laughs> traded Puffman's. We traded Puffman. Who did we trade? Uh, Mr. F is going to Michigan no! for a while. Yeah, Mr. F is such a weirdo. I like Mr. F. Yeah, we're we, he's we're, such a chill dude. We're trading. We both we have two Puffman's with Abu and Mr. F, and they're both like med students. <laughs> Oh yeah, I forgot about that. What is it about Puff student? What is it about Puff Puff? Puff's in like higher education. Yeah, get him out. <laughs> Puffs, get out. Get out of here. So when uh, we, well, we're trying to make it so when Mr. F like gets his MD, he's yeah. gonna be Doctor Mr. F. Oh, that's so good. <laughs> no, we already got Doctor Mr. PPMD. Do you want to be DQ'd out of the amateur? Oh, I don't. Oh, do want to oh, what do you think, Arjuna? Should I just de de should I just get DQ'd? What's up? Oh, sweet. All right, okay. all right, all right. Flash, uh, you want to take over for me, my booby? All right, I'm going to fly solo for a little while. I'm going to I'm gonna clean this up. Okay, I'm going to clean this up. Yeah. I'm going to clean this up. <laughs> all righty. I'll be, I'm going to be joined by another DePaul smash in a little while, but for now, uh, IRS is still in the amateur bracket. He's making it pretty far. Oh, wait. Okay, okay. Oh, no, I'm just going to talk about the match right now. Oh, that was the... Uh, I don't... Okay, he just... Whatever, deep sea diving. I wish the moon was here again this year. All right, this this could be a potentially really rough match for for Triple R, but it depends on how he plays it. Oh, you wiggle straight out. Oh, hey, what's up, buddy? All right, straight from one one part of the ball to another. We got the very own the butt zone. What up, man? Hello, my friend, my pal. What a match we have here. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> The shield delayed the hitbox of the knee and just, okay. It's always a pleasure to see Triple R come out to stuff. Yeah, he always does so well. I think he's, he's probably a top 16. Oh, what? Stage bike. Oh, oh. Oh, what? What? This is crazy. This is madness. Oh, that's a down smash. Wait, what is really He's just like flying above him. Oh, that was, that was a very interesting. Really is out of his mind right now. He's going nuts. Oh. Sees a Kirby. He just can't control himself. And you know what? Can you blame him? Feels bad when you get edge guard by Kirby. Like, like, yeah, yeah. It's it, you gotta, you just gotta shake off the stuff Kirby does to you. I think half of fighting against low tiers is just the mental stress that they put on you. It's like if I, them. if I, it's a lose lose, dude. If you won, you beat up a low tier. Good job. And if you lose, you lost to a low tier, dude. Absolutely, it's the classic David and Goliath issue. <laughs> I like how they have like team team from one side of the tier to the other on blue team. <laughs> Oh, standing the whole list. Nice this game is up right now. Wait, when, when did this happen? This game is fast and furious. If you're not paying attention, you're gonna get lost. See, every and, single, uh, it's every it's easy to get distracted. Every time I see uh, Triple R landing up to them, just like rests. But nope, <laughs> nope, <laughs> it's not there. Not quite. Do you think if Do you think if Kirby had a, a punish like rest, do you think he'd be that good? Like, you think he'd be uh, he'd be. He'd be better. How good he would be? Oh Whoa. my god. Oh yeah, fun fact, uh, up, up air is actually the strongest uh, Kirby aerial. It's pretty, it's, it's kill move. And that hitbox is, that is, that's almost a real hitbox. It's crazy. <laughs> get away, this is my kill. <laughs> He's like, no, no, Paige, get away. Wow. Get away. But uh, Absent Paige and Triple R picking up that first game win against O'Reilly and Dreffen. Wow, they're, yeah, dude, Team Minnesota is piling it on right now. Yeah, really playing playing their hearts out here. Uh, Dreffen and O'Reilly, no strangers to teaming with each other. They've definitely worked together a lot in the past, and uh, definitely no strangers to the the big melee stage. What so you, you know, that's what a you, good first game win. What do you think about the team Sheik Falcon? Like, kind of similar characters. You know, the fact that they, you know do a lot of running around and grabbing, and then yeah, the, the finishers with the aerial combos, guaranteed stuff. Oh, but, oh look at oh, really. Oh. That was so sick. He he, he uh, first hit an air reset. First hit an air, so good. 
It just leads into so much stuff, so much fun stuff if you can react to it. Funny I'm smashing. Alright, well, oh really taking a lot of damage, but uh he might be a little no he's he's gone. Yeah, I mean, at least because Falcon sometimes can struggle with edge guarding a little bit, um, and she can kind of make up for that, but I don't know. It's definitely not a super common team. Hmm. All right. Seems like Red Team's taking a better stage control on Battlefield as opposed to Dreamland. Still pretty back and forth, though. Yeah, um, they, they just got, as I say that, they get completely just yep. pushed off the stage. Blue Team just took center stage and just force them up and away, and uh, just really got to capitalize off their stage position. Oh, that might be it for Paige, though. <laughs> Wait, why would you... Oh. That was the weirdest edge guard. He makes it back, though. I can hold the edge for the team. Oh, no. He's way too far off. How good is Kirby at saving his teammates? Pretty good. Uh, because of all of his attacks suck, that you can use them to save teammates. <laughs> <laughs> the silver lining of having terrible moves. You know, like he, like a uh, page was coming in off of a fire, and he wasn't gonna like he was the ledge was being held, so he he went off the stage and nared him, and it just was fine. Wow, <laughs> it's fine, incredible. Oh, yeah, Sheik is also pretty good at saving oh. saving her teammates, which helps out with Falcon's lag of recovery. Unfortunate uh, miss of the edge there by Triple R. Yeah, she has kind of a short short range recovery though, so it, it can be a little. Risky if you go a little too far out. You're trying to yeah. trying to pull your friend from the depths. Although hitting them at the apex of the upbeat with a needle is uh, that's always helpful. Oh, he's in hole. Yeah, he's covering. And blue team holding what a the? marginal lead here. Oh man, they could, they could have done something with that. It was just so close range on the grab. Oh wait, I didn't know who was grabbed. What? The the legendary like two point five man combo, <laughs> self team combos, and oh. this started out really strong for red team, but uh, blue has managed to really uh, capitalize on their stage position, really leverage that in their advantage. Oh, Jefferson! All right, Jefferson just trying to wall them out, but not doing too well. Yeah. Uh, as and Page refuses to be walled out, and Triple R manages to get around it somehow. I have no idea I mean, how maybe, he's doing it. I mean, maybe the five jumps, but the five jumps really don't help that much. <laughs> yeah, not on stage. Oh, there we go. The back fist. Good pick up there from O'Reilly, but they definitely have their work cut out for them here. O'Reilly is hanging on by a thread. Ooh, hold it. All right, everyone's on the last stock, but uh, I think this might be... Uh, no, no, he might be the. Oh, really? Just, just, he's just like, I just want to come back. Just let me back, please. Now, Dreffen can definitely 2v1 with the best of them, but. I don't know. It, this is going to be rough. Oh, that was pretty yeah. cool. Blue Team did a great job of keeping Dreffen between them, and uh, there was really nowhere for him to go. Man, Blue Team. This, honestly, like, Hasn't Page and Triple R on a tear, dude. Yeah, I mean, they play. They must play together all the time, I assume. I so. feel like there's not that many other people to play with. <laughs> <laughs> so they've really got that synergy down pat. Hmm, all right, they're mulling over their pick. What do you, what do you think the, the choice is? They got kind of pushed around on bigger stages. They went to Battlefield, and uh, they, they had control moments, but then they kind of fell apart. They got just, like, pushed off the stage and just killed. Yeah, and the rest but. of their options aren't super great. I mean, they probably don't want to go to FD. Dreffen's probably worried about that for himself. And uh, Pokemon Stadium against a Fox. It's rough. The Falcon gets something from it, though. Yeah. All right, they probably back go back, yeah. I think that's the smartest pick. I feel like they should have gone to Yoshi's, personally. Really? Yeah. But then again, bias because I love Yoshi's. I think what Red Team's really been trying to do is keep these uh, 1v1s going, try to separate the teammates so they can't really work together, which has been their strong suit. And that's that's pretty difficult on Yoshi's. But who knows? Who knows who benefits from the organized chaos that is Yoshi's and doubles? Let's see. All right, so like you said, they're, you know, they're kind of 1v1. Okay, now they have the, the spread out a little bit. But I, I mean, it's kind of interesting. I mean, we have, we have was it uh, the second best player in Central Ohio in Columbus, and we have the third best player in Chicago. You would think that like these one v ones, like 
I mean, you know, no offense because, you know, Absent Page is amazing. And, you know, he's PR number one in Minnesota. But, like, I don't, I don't know, like, with the character matchups, like, at least, at least for Triple R, I feel like that having 1v1s would be a huge, like, a problem for Triple R. But he's just so good. Yeah, he's just managing to, like, weave his little Kirby body in and out of danger so well. Oh, goodbye. That's, uh, that's never what you want to see coming out. Oh, that drill reset was so good. Oh, the edge cancel up there. That was sick. It's going to keep moving around. They're trying. He just. After Page is so fast. He's doing the whole, like, we were saying he's, like, doing the Kung Fu Fight, like, Ipon thing, where he's, like, just, like, blocking blocking one and then hitting the other and then blocking both of them and then hitting them both away. Yeah, absolutely. Kung Fu Master. He's doing it so well. I mean, Red Team strategy really at this point is kind of come to the point of hit Kirby away oh, and try to kill the Fox. Yo, from right there, uh, so Dreffin tried to fair oh, really back to the stage, and he fared him, and so Azure Page saw that, and he nared where the fair would send him, and he killed him off of it. Up there, up there. And that's what we're talking about when we uh, mentioned the synergy of these players. Just have worked together so long, so well. They just know what's going on oh. at all times. I was about to say, is this going to be another uh, another Triple R four stock game where he has four stock and everybody else has one? <laughs> yeah, against Azu and Nubs uh, earlier, there everyone like uh, Azu Page, Azu and Nubs all had one stock, and then um, that Triple R had all four of his stocks still at like 100. percent That's incredible. It's an FD too. I don't understand how <laughs> he makes Kirby live for so long. I mean, he's got the jumps, but he's wow. so light. I just realized crouching Kirby is actually very good, very good in both of these matchups. Yeah, it's it's uh, a little tricky to deal with crouching Kirby as a grab heavy character. I'm surprised it took you that long though. You are the <laughs> connoisseur of flat Kirby's. Yeah, I mean, I, oh, I mean, do you think meaty hit? Yeah, I, could you imagine if you know? Have you seen the um the was it making Kirby viable thing? No, I haven't. I feel like. Oh, I can't. I can't even imagine how like his edge guards. Were. Oh, that was a sick edge. Guard. Oh, that. I just realized. I think we might be playing on an old version of melee because if you saw when uh, uh when uh Triple R died, he went to he went from zero back to zero. Like his percent reappeared and then it like disappeared and then it like reset. Oh, interesting. Is, Is that a sign. version specific option? Uh, I think so. Yeah, but anyway, red, uh, red team is bringing this back though. Yeah, like, it's actually kind of close. Oh, so that could have been really bad. I mean, he's at low percent, but still, if that was like a nipple spike, that would have been very bad. Oh, but now they're going in on... Oh, okay, no, that's all they needed. Yeah, Dreffen had a couple of really clutch edge guards to keep this super close. <laughs> what was a uh, down smash? Wow. Read the platform? That was sick. Was not enough. And the 3-0 coming out from Minnesota. <laughs> Minnesota making it into winner's semis. Congratulations to them. And that is uh, that's a good win for them. No matter who you are, that's a good win. Or sorry, winners and losers semis. Ugh. Yeah, hmm. props to Minnesota for that. They're still sitting down, so I think they might be playing now. But don't we have another side of the losers' quarters? I actually have no idea where we are in the bracket right now. Me either. The only thing I know right now from sitting here is that they are playing Marvel. So, when's Marvel? When's Marvel? Now. now. Ah. Do we have any... Oh, K-Brad's here. Yeah. I was watching him play Street Fighter a little earlier. <laughs> he was uh, definitely perfecting people. He's definitely taking souls. Dang. Sometimes this game is so jank. Yeah, honestly, if you guys are in the Midwest area and you are looking for a fun and interesting regional, not just for Smash, but for fighting games in general, and just a, a overall good time, a two-day event, you should definitely t come out to Brookfield, Wisconsin. It's basically Milwaukee. But Yeah, I've had a lot of fun here at Kings of the North. It's uh, a lot of fun. You get to see a lot of stuff. They've had a mystery.